A clipping path gives you the ability to mask out certain parts of an image. Now InDesign isn't created to do image editing, but let's say I have this picture of the deer that I want to place on top of my text. I need to get rid of this white area. Here's the simplest way to do it. With the image selected, go to Object, down to Clipping Path, and open up the Options. This will bring up our Options dialog box. I've got Preview turned on so I can see what it's going to do. Now, there are some advanced things you can do with clipping paths, but I'm going to keep this one very simple. Notice that the type of image I'm using is very high contrast, dark image on a very white background. From Type, I can choose to detect the edges of the image. In other words, it's going to look for the edges of the lights and the darks. With it, notice now I've got little vector points that are going around my image. And I can choose the threshold of the light and dark areas by changing up the tolerance. Usually higher or lower images will do a better job of adding points and clipping out your images. So you may want to play around with this. Next, notice that it's only getting the outside edges. For instance, in between the legs here is not being clipped off, or even up here in the antlers is not being clipped out. If I choose to include the inside edges, now notice that the inner edges are also being clipped off as well. So you may need to play around to give yourself the best results to work with. I'm going to set my tolerance for the white to be really low. Notice I've got a lot of points. and My tolerance for the black to be very high. That's doing a pretty good job for there. Once I'm done, I can hit OK. And now it's clipped off the entire area that I'm working with. 